In this video, we're going to explore the more advanced designer option for creating collateral across several different communication channels. We tell you right up front that these designer templates are recommended for more experienced users, but have no fear. Whether you are a seasoned graphics pro or if you're just experienced enough to be confident and adventurous, you can always download this how-to guide that gives you detailed written instructions for each of the tabs. We're sure that you can do it and we want to set you up for success. Now getting back to our various communication channels, we can create a flyer, a postcard, a header for an email blast, or a social media post. Each one has different requirements for image dimensions and resolutions. Your event flyer has a space for your image that is proportionately wider and less tall than the event postcard. On the postcard, you can see that she's holding a cup of tea, and on the flyer, the teacup is not visible. Similarly, the resolution you need on an image in a social media post is not quite as high as if you're printing the image on a postcard or flyer. So you can create matching assets for the event and the system will reformat the image especially for its medium. Let me show you. Let's create a flyer and go into the design tab. I'll choose the 4th of July image because we love the 4th of July and we can see the different dimensions on it. The graphic frame width here is 8 and 3 quarters inches and the height is a little more than three and a half inches. Why wider than the standard sheet of paper? So our image will extend all the way to the edge of the page with no margin. And you can see that even if I resize the printable part of the image, the height to width ratio is locked. Now let me close it out and go to a social media post. I'll choose the same image and now it creates a box for the printable part of the image that's eight and a half inches wide and 4.19 inches tall. I'll get a successfully formatted image each and every time. And if we look at the proof of our social media post by saving the content and updating the proof, we can see that the image fits as planned. And we can order the downloadable image by clicking here to acknowledge that the proof is good and adding it to my cart. I hope this video has been helpful. Thanks for watching.